what you see behind me is the second largest ice sheet in the world and that is in uh, Greenland. Greetings from Greenland. Today I will be on another adventure and that is to uh, step on the world's second largest uh, ice sheet. So uh, I will uh, share the experience with you on in uh, this video. The bus uh, just uh, made a quick stop here. This is the bus to uh, to the ice cap in uh, in Greenland in Kangerlussuaq, Greenland. And uh, interestingly enough, it's the same stop that we made uh, yesterday. I'm not sure if you watched the video yesterday for the Russell Glacier uh, visit. And, uh, but this uh, visit is a little bit different because the, uh, the tour guide is a little bit, uh, um, has more knowledge and uh, today's uh, tour is a little bit crowded, more, more people. So if you're visiting um, Greenland ice cap in the future, 99.9% .9 you will be on, on one of those buses. You're not gonna be able to do it on your own. It's not like you're gonna be able to rent a car and uh, drive on your own. No, this doesn't work like that. So you will have to take those uh, one of those buses um, when you uh, when you arrive in uh, Kangerlussuaq. So I am uh, now on my way to the ice cap, and we will get the opportunity to to walk on the actual ice cap. And that ice cap is the uh, is the second largest uh, ice cap in the world. The largest one is definitely in the Antarct Antarctica, but this uh, this one is the second one. And uh, I love this view, and this is a wonderful view that I saw that I saw yesterday as well. And uh, he's doing some explanation. I'm gonna have to uh, to join join them and see what they're talking about and uh, anyway I will stop filming and we'll, uh, we'll resume the filming when I get to the uh, ice cap this is one of the bus stops along the uh, along the way to the ice cap and I thought uh, why not uh, why not uh, make a video here it is really really beautiful uh, beautiful over here so uh, what a beautiful, uh, it's a little bit, uh, it's a little bit chilly. So this is on the way to the ice cap. And uh, you're gonna make a quick stop here just to enjoy, uh, to enjoy the view. As you can see right now, I'm covering my ears. It's so cold here. What a beautiful, uh, what a beautiful sight. Isn't it? Isn't it something? Wow. Let me give you uh let me give you the whole view. Uh. So the moment has arrived now we're actually walking toward the ice cap we're gonna start the journey from here and uh, the bus just uh, stopped there over there and now we will uh, follow the the guide to guide us through this uh, magnificent uh, place what a beautiful place we will uh, walk uh, on the on the ice cap in just about uh, 10 minutes.
Yeah. And we'll also go on to the ice and there I will also like you all to stay behind me. If any of you want to return, though, that's okay, you can just return. I will do the counts when we come back to the bus. So, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I can't, I can't, yeah, can see on the ice who's returned, so I, it doesn't matter, I can't do that. So, we go back to the bus, I'll check if everybody's there. Yes. Yes, start. I would uh, advise you all to wear gloves. Not so much uh, because of the cold, but uh, of course it's very rockety when you go under the rain, so it's nice to have gloves if it's cold. And the ice, you'll experience when you get on the ice, because it's melting, it's crunching under your feet. Look, like I'm getting closer to the, to the ice cap, and it's getting really, really cold, as you can see in front of me we're almost there it's quite a, it's quite a bit of a, a hike uh, from the uh, from the bus stop all the way to the actual um, ice cap and I would say it's a little bit challenging you, you, sh you should bring uh, very very good uh, good hiking shoes and I made a mistake I forgot my I forgot to bring gloves because I was supposed to wear gloves Shot on the other side of the bridge okay I'm supposed to wear gloves but anyway I totally forgot to bring them See, uh, a lot of people uh, are visiting this place, and uh, I would say probably about 20, 20 people total, 20 to 25 people total, and they made all all these efforts to get to uh, to where we are right now. It's one of the most amazing places on earth it is actually the most amazing places on earth you look uh, I can't believe I'm stepping now on the second largest ice sheet on earth all right I am now stepping on the actual ice you see isn't it something I'm wearing these shoes over here. And it's called uh, point six sixty because it's uh 660 meters above uh, above ground and if I'm not mistaken Kangarlooswak town um, is uh, about 25 meters above uh, ground and as you can see uh, some ice is uh, a black and the black ice uh, seems to have more more water in it I have to be very, very conscientious uh, where I'm stepping. I don't want to trip. I don't want to fall because I did not bring uh, my my gloves. And the gentleman recommended gloves to protect your uh, your um, your hands in case uh, you you fall. 
that was the big mistake I I made. I did not bring my 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 gloves. But now you're learning from my mistake. So if you're planning this trip in the future, you know what to do. Bring bring your gloves and wear a good hiking shoes. That part I did. I did bring good hiking shoes that uh, that are good for this kind of environment. Look at this water flowing. So you can see, I'll point the camera this, this direction, you can see the view over here, the view of the ice cap. And I was told that this ice is about 25 years old, so I need to uh, fact uh, check. Um, this uh, this uh, information and uh, wow I need to be very careful over here I'm gonna try to uh, to film as much as I can this would definitely make it for a rather nice uh, video Wow a little bit challenging to uh, to film in this kind of environment what you see behind me is the second largest ice sheet in the world and that place is in uh, Greenland and this is the second to the other place in uh, Antarctica so I got the opportunity to uh, to walk around but uh, you're not allowed to go to certain places for safety reason so I was uh, I was asked not to go uh, any further for safety reason and now uh, I'm gonna have to head back to um, to go back and as you can see a lot of people uh, are already uh, leaving and uh, and for now I'm gonna wrap up this video and I really hope you enjoyed uh, this video there will be a lot of uh, videos uh, in Greenland so have a, have a good day and take uh, take uh, care bye bye